Have you aught to say for yourself? For what you have done to our people? Your people. I was betrayed by your people. <laughs> My people, he says. The precious lordling beloved by all come to confront the wicked witch. My parents taught me no better. They woke me from dawn to dust like an ox or an ass or some other beast of burden. Until, that is, my brother spied a chance to transform the family fortunes. And so I was married to a vicious old drunk, who beat me as he pleased. And when I pleaded for help, I was told to grin and bear it. For the family, for him, for everyone's sake. They pretended not to notice, but they knew. They knew! What did it matter? I was nothing to them. Less than nothing. I wasn't of their flesh, I wasn't a fellow Doman, I wasn't even a person! I might just as well have been dead! And then my husband passed away one day. And so I was sold off yet again to pay his debts. But this time, this time, I found a way to live for myself. To survive as a spy for the Empire. Oh, those were the days when the scales first fell from my eyes. No longer would I be a slave to my parents or my husband or the Pleasure House. I would be free and receive due compensation. That would be enough, I thought until I saw a doorman in the road, beaten and broken. And my heart... My heart skipped a beat. Lying at my feet, groaning in agony, sobbing in despair. Powerless, helpless, hopeless. A vision forever seared into my soul. Oh boy. Oh. There was nothing I would not do to feel that joy again. To bend this cruel, twisted world to my whims. <sighs> now, having borne witness to my life's work, have you to say to me? You are one crazy bitch. <laughs> Twas kind of you to lend me your ear, my lord. But now it is time for us to conclude our little tete-a-tete -tete with a final game of chance. Who shall stand, and who shall fall? Let the die be cast. This was her plan from the first, to bring the keep down on our heads! I will remember your words. We must yeah. flee. Order our forces to withdraw. You still can! I cannot hold this forever! 
No, we will not leave you behind! Do your duty! Deliver Lord Hien and the others to safety! Now! Forthwith! I shall manage on my own! Oh shit. She survived. No. No one leaves. Not you or anyone else. This old friend cannot bear. Go now, all of you. The day is won, and the morrow beckons. Do not despair, my friend. Never before have I felt so alive. My eyes unclouded my purpose clear. This is right. Gorsetsu. You never failed us. Not once. You served my father faithfully. And I'm a better man for your guidance. And the Doma we built together shall be better for it too. Be proud, my friend. Be proud. I am Shun. More than you know. I mean, they could still be alive, right? How merciful the gods that I should find you in time. Kasetsu? We must turn back now before it is too late! Eyes forward, Serena. That was his wish. I will deliver you to safety. The others are waiting.
That was fast. Someone has to always die. We brought everyone here. You were the last to arrive. I see. Thank you. We owe the Confederacy a great debt. I have waited 25 years for this moment. You owe us naught. It's Lord Hien! Lord Hien! It's him! He lives! He lives! Some few words of encouragement would not go amiss, my lord. Uh, right. Uh, yes, uh, of course. <laughs> Hearing you say that, I find my courage somehow renewed. Much obliged. We are a sorry lot, are we not? Tired, dirty, stinking of blood and sweat and ash. The people push to the point of breaking. And yet, we won. 
The perseverance to endure decades of oppression. The will to carry on the legacy of those we have lost. These were the bonds that held us together and gave us the strength to reclaim our home. After 25 hard years, the shadow of the Empire no longer darkens these lands, and we may at last look forward to the dawning of a new day. But, my friends, it will be a day of work. So I ask you, have you yet the strength to stand? To rise up with me once more, here and now, and begin to rebuild our homeland? This will not end with Doma. We will see to that. Right, Lise? Right. Indeed, this is but the beginning. The tide is turning, and it shall soon bear us back across the seas and onward and to the next battlefield.